going to be Saurabh Verma to serve love all in the first game. Tarun M wins the first point, smashing his way. One nil, Saurabh receiving. This time, Tarun smash goes into the deep part of the court in Saurabh's area and Tarun M takes the lead to 2-0 he had spoken after his victory in the semi-finals about how he wants to improve on his attack so we saw the first two points with his quick attack but Saurabh Verma has got his account going now 1-2 Saurabh Verma to serve Both players getting into the dribbling challenge and Saurabh Verma coming out on top to all it is. Or Verma gets into one of his trademark rallies. He's considered to be a master tactician and engaging Tarunam here in a rally for winning the point. Three, two, Sir Verma to serve. This is the first game in the men's singles final here at the 37th National Games. Enjoyed that. Did M turn three four. Both players getting the major measure of each other's abilities and exploring this their strategies as well. For um, the battle has only just begun. Both players are probing to check on the weaknesses of each other of course they know about each other's games they must have seen each other for a long time but this is the national games man singles final and every player would aim to outwit the other and must have some tricks up their sleeve because it doesn't get bigger than the final for now, Saurabh Verma lead 5-4. And uh, we have uh, the experience of uh, Tarun taking on the comeback man, as I'm calling him, Saurabh Verma. Very humble in his approach as well in conversation with uh, all our staff and out here at the Dudashan Network. Whenever he spoke after his games, very humble in his approach, but very hardworking. And you can see that. That is a little wide and uh, speaking of his comeback, he, he has been out of the game for a while but 
uh, on this return journey if he can win the gold medal it will truly cap a fantastic year for him with uh, Saurabh Varma from Madhya Pradesh who would win the gold if he wins this but Telangana will be hoping that they win a gold they missed out narrowly or I should say they missed out quite completely in the first game the uh, first seeded duo but they'll be looking Telangana will be looking to have at least another shot at a sec another gold medal Saurabh Varma can see he's dishing out his attacking weapon as well quite an immaculate smasher early days here seven five in the first game Fantastic drop shot there by uh, Saurabh Verma this time. He had a great control over the point. He knew exactly where he was going to maneuver M. Tarun around the court and then finishes, finishes off the rally with that delightful drop shot and takes the total score now at 8-5. A lead of three points for Saurabh in this first game of the final. Very, very sharp smash this time by M. Tarun directed at the body of Saurabh Verma. And that was a very good point, very authoritative statement as well. Eight all uh, in this uh, finals between the men's categories between uh, Saurabh Verma and Tarun from uh, Telangana. It's uh, neck and neck. And uh, by asking players if. A little bit of confusion out here. Tarun wants the shuttle to be changed, but the official directing him to continue playing. I don't think Saurabh had a problem with that, but I think the official refused to let go of his decision. Oh wow, that was a fantastic jump smash shot, overhand hit. No chance for Saurabh Verma there, he did get to it, but there was uh, no way that he was able to return that smash. Absolutely, it was rifled in tremendous power by M. Tarun. Getting a lead of one point now. It's 9 8 in this first game, and we look set for a very, very intense battle for sure for the gold medal. We see Tarun taking a bit of an, uh, a lead in this game. 10-8 uh, right now. The score stands with, Varmato, with uh, Tarun to serve. And just like that, he takes a three-point lead in this match. Uh, he is the fourth-seeded player out here, M. Tarun. And uh, he's taking on uh, Saurabh Verma for Madhya Pradesh as we go into the mid-game break. Of course, we're going to be seeing live action on the Doodarshan Network at the finals at the 37th National Games being held at the Dr. Shama Prasad Mukherjee Stadium. We're coming to you on our YouTube channel as well. 
remember folks you can uh, join us out here this is the second match of the day and uh, we will be having the next set of games a little later on in uh, today from uh, 2 30 in the afternoon we'll have the women's doubles finals of Shikha Gautam and Ashwini Bhatt from Karnataka taking on Simran Singhi and Ritika Thakir from Maharashtra that will be followed by Anupama Uthadhyaya versus Aditi Bhatt in the women's singles final and a final match will be the men's double finals between Karnataka pair of Nitin and Prithvi Roy taking on Hari Haram and Ruban Kumar from Tamil Nadu. 12-8 is the score with uh, Tarun leading right now. Finally, a point for Saurabh Verma. That's going to get his confidence going. Crowd also uh, cheering him on. This is definitely going to give him a lot more confidence. Straight down the line. Perfect smash. Thirteen nine in the favor of Tarun from Telangana. He's ready to serve and try to take the first set. Sort of Burma isn't going anywhere. Finally, see a little more emotion from the player from Madhya Pradesh. Ten. 13, Saurabh Burma is going to be serving now. Needs to get his rhythm back into the game. And make his way back. 3 points, the deficit right now with Burma serving. Wavered, wavered hitting there at the net. Causing the score to now reflect 10-14 in favour of Tarun from Telangana. It's an interesting battle that is taking place out here on Sindakut. On, on this uh, fantastic Tuesday. Gotta say happy uh, Dashera to everyone as well out there celebrating the festival. Uh, we're going to be seeing it, it. We're going to be seeing the players uh, hoping that it's an auspicious day for them. Each of them will be hoping it's auspicious for them. But let's watch the action once more as it resumes. Just a bit wide here by Sarah Burma. The tap at the net is trying to explore various angles here with his placements this time they don't come well enough and it's a five point lead for Amtharu 15 10 in the first game And Tarun, a highly talented youngster, gave a great account of his makeup, the character, uh, the the making of the champion that he is. We saw in the semi-final how he came back from losing the first game in a very very incredible manner. He lost the first game to Mithun Manjunath, 12-21. But then he staged a great fight back and won the next two, two games, 21-14, 22-20 and entered the final and here he is leading Saurabh Verma, the experienced shuttler, 15-11, Verma to serve.
the net there saving uh, Saurabh that was very lucky Tarun is a little upset with himself that he could not get that he lined it up well and once again asking for a change in shuttle but uh, Saurabh Barma doesn't wish to change his Fine games being played out here between both players for sure. You could see the coach uh, signaling to uh, Am Tarun from the sidelines to just relax, calm down, accept it, not get flustered about it. Saurabh Burma going about his task quite silently. 13.15 it is. Badminton is the fastest sport in the world and for a reason, for the knowledge of our viewers, uh, we would like to tell them that the, f that the record for the fastest badminton shot ever played is in the name of an Indian, of course, a talented Indian, Satvik Sairaj Rankireddy broke a decade-old Guinness World Record for the fastest sh shot ever in badminton with an astonishing 565 kilometer an hour smash. The earlier record was 493 kilometer per hour by Malaysian player Tan Boon Hume. Thirteen six. Hey, thank you, Neeraj, for that little bit of interesting trivia there. It's nice to know that the Guinness record for the fastest smash is currently held by an Indian. That too, 565. What incredible hitting that must have been. Absolutely. And we see some amazing smashes here uh, as well in this badminton event of the national games. And here in this final, Saurabh Verma and Tarun M have also displayed their smashing ability. That is wide and it's a two-point lead. It's a very well contested first set of the match out here. Both players uh, having a little bit of respect for their opponents and uh, we see a narrow lead for M. Tarun. Two points is the difference between both players as he serves. Saurabh Verma committing the error at the net here is trying to place with his backhand, backhand tap, finding the tape of the net. Three point lead for Tarun M. It's 18-15. Tarun M, man of few words, he believes in speaking loudly with his actions rather than words, but he had, he had given an insight into what his uh, strategy would be in the final here and it was about improving the attack and there you saw the glimpse of how he is going to smash every opportunity it's 21 15 and Tarun Varma has bagged the first game here in this all-important men's singles finals the prestigious gold medal is at stake here at the 37th national games and Tarun M has looked apart but the job is only half done and you can never rule out a fight back from Saurabh Burma, the absolutely incredible tactical shuttler that he is down here has lost the first game. What can he do in the second? We have to wait and watch and enjoy this 
excellent battle between young Tarun M and an experienced Saurabh Verma who's making a very hard push to get back to his glory days. After a spell on sidelines with COVID, Saurabh Verma is now coming back and playing in his rhythm of the heydays he was known around for his prowess and rallies and we have seen it enough here in the 37 national games but it's time that you make the biggest effort of it all and that's the final stage and here we see Saurabh Verma trailing Tarun M as the Telangana youngster back the first game 21-15 and is now set to start the second game love all the first points of the second set going the way of Saurabh Verma good start for him he'll be looking to capitalize on every single point that he can and try and close this out as quickly as possible and take the match into a final game and that is far wide Tarun having a word with his uh, coach not happy with something with his own performance there at that point of time was completely caught out on one side Just like that, three points in a row for Saurabh Verma, who goes about doing all his talking on the court. Neeraj, absolutely fantastic player I've seen in this tournament. First four points going Saurabh Verma's way and this is the right kind of a start that he would have hoped for having lost the first game to 15-21 Saurabh Verma leads in the second game 4-0 this will give him great confidence to wage the battle and stage a fight back to level the proceedings and I, that jump shot smash there just waiting on the official call from the umpire who says that it is wide but our chair official deemed that to be within bounds and opened up the first point for Tarun Saurabh Verma has once again established a five point lead as he serves in this second set I think Saurabh is now playing a very calculated game again. Conditions on this side of the court are different from the other side and you have to change and adjust your game throughout the match. Cannot just be reliant. As I was saying, you just can't be reliant on one single strategy, Neeraj. You have to change uh, as per the game and as per the drift that's happening in, on centre court. Absolutely. We have spoken time and again uh, with regards to the drift and one end being a fast court and the other being slow. So the players have to adapt quickly before they get into their strokes and they should know how to adapt. This time 7-1 the lead, the score in the second game. Saurabh Verma is 
busy rearing his rallies and you can see that he is definitely getting a great rhythm in this game. You know when he is moving around so well with his strokes, tosses and then deft flicks, drop shots at the net. He is toying with Tarun M and has taken a commanding 8 point lead now. 9-1 is the score in the second game. 10-1 it is and for some reason Tarun M has looked unsettled in the second game. This time he makes an emphatic smash on the right court of Saurabh M. Saurabh didn't even move as he was out of position with so much space to go for for Tarun M. A wider smash this time draws an error and it's a seven point uh, deficit yet for Tarun M to serve. Very inconsistent performance so far by Tarun M in the second game and uh, Saurabh Varma has looked absolutely in control. It's 11 3. Uh, yes, we can see that. Uh, Tarun is clearly rattled in this match, uh, in the second set of this match, not happy with himself at all and again as we have been speaking throughout this tournament, today is the fifth day of badminton uh, out here and uh, we still are talking about the drift, the players have been experiencing it on centre court, it is slightly different on the extreme ends of the court that they have, if they have been playing on court number uh, three or if they're playing on court number four the drift is slightly different than it has been on center court and uh, we've seen Saurabh Varma now taking a commanding lead in this uh, match will be hoping to win the point yesterday uh, Tarun was trailing in the first set and then he made a comeback so it looks like Saurabh Varma is doing the same in this set wide means the lead is now seven points yes Tarun was uh, not happy with himself uh, for committing that error he knew he had to go down the line but he could not uh, place it in inside the line a very very accurate uh, tap this time at the net gives him a point it's eight points lead for Saurabh Verma from MP Little lose uh, this time in his uh, approach. So far, we have seen him playing a very tight game in this second game. That's in. Tarun M started to show a bit of compactness. The Vayas replied to the attack and also turned it into his forte. His attacking game was very impressive in the first game and now he is here in the deficit by six points but you can never write him off. He saw what he can deliver yesterday after losing first game easily. That was brilliant. He was so close to the net and yet he avoided touching it with the racket. That would have been a foul. And the point going the other way but he could finish the tap in a very, very beautiful manner. 7-12. Thirteen seven there. Verma getting a little lucky at the net. He 
it looks like Tarun is panting and heaving. He's going to have to dig deep in this match if he wants to win it. Excellent point there from Tarun. Lovely rally from both players. In complete control of those shots was Tarun until the final point of delivery, making it impossible for Varma to return. Yes, Tarun M has the ability to surprise even the best in the business. Saurabh Verma definitely getting a good challenge from the youngster here. Tarun M has cut down the lead which was at uh, one point in time. Uh, eight points to now just four points. And one can sense here that Tarun M has finally got the hang of the condition at this end of the court. Serving 9-13 in the second game. Good smash by Saurabh Varma takes the total to 14-9. You're watching the live telecast of the men's singles final here at the 37 National Games Badminton Individual Championships. And we have three more finals lined up for you. But uh, the action will resume at 2.30 as uh, there is a long break after the end of uh, this final here at the Shama Prasad Mukherjee Stadium. So if you are listening or viewing our telecast uh, on YouTube when you are in and around Goa you can come in to the SPM stadium to witness a grand battle that is uh, in store in the post lunch session four point lead now we can see the fight from us Tarun not ready to let go of uh, this game is it possible that he can come back? Neeraj, I, it looks like there is a fight in him still left. Uh, only time will tell if he can take this game. The net coming to the rescue there of Saurabh Varma once again establishing a five point lead. It looks a little comfortable for him right now. Tarun will try to keep the pressure on his opponent and maybe under pressure Saurabh Varma might buckle but so far he is standing strong. Easy point there. Saurabh Verma was completely out thought uh, here by Tarun M. Tarun M has uh, quite a lot of skills in his arsenal, and we saw here how he maneuvered Saurabh Verma. How he maneuvered Saurabh Verma at the deep end and then placed the final tap in the vacant left side of the court. Saurabh Verma hopelessly out of position. That's the classy battle here and we expect it to be in all events. Well played, Saurabh Verma. He was relentless there in his line of smashing, first targeting the body and then going for the kill in the four court. 16 12. Saurabh Verma leads a margin of four points in the second game. He had lost the first game of 15 21 to M. Tarun. And the viewers and our spectators here at the SPM Stadium will be hoping that this final gets into the third and final game because uh, no neutral or badminton lover would want a battle to end quickly and would rather hope that it goes 
the entire distance. Seventeen twelve, Saurabh Verma in control. This time the dribbling lets him down. The dribbling is the process of a play wherein your skills are at the closing part of the net. Sure step delicately the shuttle over the net and keep your partner near the net before you place a lift into the back end of the court in trying to outmaneuver the opponent. We've seen some very very beautiful dribbling skills in the badminton competition here. Tarun M really is carrying some sort of resistance up there in this game. In the earlier part of the second game, he looked to have fallen way behind, but he has been hanging in there. The lead is just four points that he has to cut out. It's in, gets a point. Takes his total to 15, it's 3 points now, the deficit, Tarun M targeting the gold medal, is going all out for it. Of course, Saurabh Verma is also intensely fighting it out, the situation and the challenge that he has in his hands because he is the one who has lost the first game and to restore parity he needs to win. This game is just 2 points away from the game point. Twenty fifteen. One point away from bagging the game is uh, Saurabh Verma and beautifully done by M. Taruni. Surprised uh, Saurabh Verma by placing that uh, close in dribble tap. Uh, at the extreme right end of Saurabh and he could not uh, reach it. 16-20. Saurabh Verma gets the point and backs the second game. So it's one game all here. Elroy, we are in for the decider. The third and final game will, uh, will uh, give us the winner of the gold medal here. Yes, absolutely right, Neeraj. This has been a battle, an intense battle between both players. 15-21 is what sort of lost the first set and uh, he went on to win the second one 21-16 so we now have the bit of a breather players are grabbing a bite to eat something to drink they need to keep their energy levels high it's been an intense match it's been on for almost the better part of an hour out here at the Shama Prasad Mukherjee Stadium Saurabh Varma and uh, Tarun M battling it out in the finals of the men's singles action for the gold medal which is up for grabs. Both players having a change of shirts as well. It is uh, interesting to note that this game is now going into the tiebreaker set. The man from Madhya Pradesh taking on the lad from Telangana coaches having a word with Tarun M. Saurabh Verma doesn't seem to have anyone in his in his uh, corner. Seems to be very relaxed. And that is the beauty of uh, watching Saurabh Verma play. Even yesterday when he was taking on Dani Harshil, very talented player from Maharashtra. 
extremely tall, extremely athletically fit, long reach, long levers as they say. But Saurabh Badma was a technical and tactical genius in that match, outmaneuvering his opponent. Will he be able to do the same in this game or will Tarun figure out his opponent? He did it in the first set and he's playing from that side once again. Let's see if that will help him in this decider. Well, well, this is the third and final game coming up in this battle for the gold medal in the men's singles event. Saurabh Barma serving love all in the third game. Tarun M sets the tone here with an authentic, emphatic smash. 1-0 Tarun M. He needs to keep a very, very focused mind and very clear mind and not get uh, flustered about any other aspect. In the first half of the second game, he looked a bit unsettled. He was not happy with something and his game uh, was affected. Now he looks fresh and ready to go. Two points already in his bag in this third and final game of the men's singles final. Intense set of smashes there from Tarun. He's come out very determined in uh, the tiebreaker set. I think the words of advice and encouragement from his coaches uh, seems to have done its job. We have both players resuming action now on centre court. Sends a smash from his end into the M. Tarun area, gets a point. This is going to be one fight to the finish, Elroy. I'm sure there is a lot to come from Saurabh Verma as he has a lot of experience with different kinds of situations. A three-time former national champion as well, Saurabh to serve one three. Fighting back there is Saurabh Barma after losing the first three points of this match, making a comeback. But it's still a long way to go in this deciding tiebreak set. Four two is the score. This, of course, the third and final set in the men's singles action for today. No chance, no chance there for Tarun Saurabh in complete control of that rally. And of course, even though Tarun did return the first match, he had absolutely no chance for the next one. True Saurabh Verma in total control. Although it is lagging behind by just a point. Four all now. The silky dribbling skills here of Saurabh Verma to the four. A complete player, they call him a very intelligent player as well. The experts in the Indian badminton circuit. But the young gun, Tarun M, is definitely keeping Saurabh Verma on his toes. Very impressive so far has been M. Tarun from Telangana. Saurabh Verma wanted to execute the drop shot from the deep end of his court but 
at times they don't come off and that's what happened for Verma this time Excellent point here for Amtarun, of course, Saurabh Verma, don't look impressed. Not happy with the call, but uh, the players get on with it. Amtarun had smashed very hard in this point and uh, Saurabh Verma retrieved the shuttle excellently. Diving effort uh, on his uh, left side to retrieve that smash. Exhibiting a very good compact defense. And then with his net approach play before he judges that high return. Or rather misjudges it as the shuttle lands in. The right call was eventually made. Tarun M leading in this third and final game, 7-4. What a rally there we've seen, uh, Saurabh Varma talking to himself, wondering what more could he do in that. Tarun had all the answers in that game, diving to his left, smashing a couple of times, uh, sort of returning very efficiently as well, but Tarun coming with all the answers out there, landing that one precisely where he wanted to. No chance, as you can see, him smashing it a couple of times with Saurabh Varma, trying his level best, and then sending the shuttle wide off the court to earn a valuable point for Tarun who now has a four point lead in this match. The battle for the men's singles gold medal has now reached 50 minutes. Absolutely compelling viewing for sure of viewers enjoying the live telecast on Doodashin from all around the world it doesn't get bigger and better than watching the finals here at the 37 national games and Tarun has taken a hold on this Third and final game for sure. He leads Saurabh Verma by six points. The young, talented player from Telangana, Tarun M. The up and coming rising star of Indian badminton, M. Tarun, leads the experienced Saurabh Verma. 10 4 in this third and deciding set. The first game was. Won by Am Tarun, 21-15. But Saurabh Verma bounced back by winning the second game and leveled the tie, 21-16. But here in the third and final game, stand four in Tarun's favour. At the net, we see the lead now down to just five points. The players have been flying about, diving around as they try to extend their reach to win the medal hopes for their states. They're literally diving for everything that they can. We are witnessing an excellent final out here. A treat to watch. It's gone into the tiebreaker just as we would have wanted it to. No neutral wants the game to just be a one-sided match and Saurabh Varma is going to try to serve and close in the gap of 5 points. It 
it's a remarkable rally that has led to 11-5 being the score in this third and final set in the favor of M. Tarun. Fantastic smashing by the young man from Telangana. Saurabh Burma tried to mix it up and went for that drop shot but could not clear the net. And that's how M. Tarun took the points tally to 11 and change of ends in this decider will mean both the players getting a different set of conditions now. Every end has its own challenges. That's what the players have discussed. But it's the third and final set. Both have played at the, both the ends in the earlier games as well. So are, they are pretty much settled with the aspect of the conditions. Now it's all about the heart, the desire and the application. The player who needs it more, desires for the gold more, almost certainly will make a big effort, show a big heart and glory will belong to the player who never says it's over until it's over. Sora Burma is fighting. You see his defensive makeup there. Somehow he has kept going despite a barrage of smashing attacks from M. Tarun, who has smashed them with greater power than Sora. Tarun M has now taken the route of high velocity smashing his smashing has been accurate as well but most of the time Saurabh Burma has found answers to it but that has not happened here this time it's M. Tarun who leads by 6 points 12-6 is the score in Tarun's favor That is wide, which means the score difference is also quite wide right now. Seven point difference. Tarun, who's the fourth seeded player out here, the between the two of them, he is the higher ranked opponent, of course. Saurabh Verma has been playing fantastic badminton. A little waver there from uh, Tarun. And uh, once again, shoots that wide and he requests for the court to be wiped down we're going to be having the medal ceremony after this game we also had the previous match where we had the winners of the gold medal in the mixed doubles finals going to Andhra Pradesh Gusek and Pujadi winning gold with Navneet Boka and Manisha K from Telangana settling for silver What a point here and the applause says it all. One of the best rallies of this men's singles final for sure. Saurabh Burma gets a well-deserved point. 8-13. He still trails M. Tarun by 5 points in this gold medal match here at the 37th National Games Goa 2023. 
You're watching the live telecast on the Doordarshan network from Dr. Shama Prasad Mukherjee in our stadium here at Taligaon Plateau near Panji, Goa. Very, very accurate overhead forehand into the forecourt for Tarun was totally out of position to deal with it. Excellent point here by Saurabh Verma. I saw this great exhibition of retrieving how he always came up with the answers to the smashes from M. Tarun and managed to move M. Tarun around. Finally drawing an error as M. Tarun went for the long toss. Saurabh Verma, the man who can never be ruled out or written off is scripting a fight back here he trails M. Tharun by 4 points in this deciding third game of the men's singles final Elroy, this is badminton of highest level as we see here the two of the national talents dishing it out absolutely right Neeraj top class quality on display out here Verma isn't done just yet. He is giving a very good account of himself. 14-9 is the score right now. I think Saurabh Verma is going to fight this out to the end. 5 point deficit but he isn't someone who is just going to call it quits. They are fighting for the gold medal of course. Another successful point there from Saurabh Verma. Once more the lead down to just four points. Incredible, incredible game being played. An amazing exhibition of great skills and endurance here we are watching the finals of the men's singles event from Dr. Shama Prasad Mukherjee Stadium here at Taligaon Plateau near Panji Goa Saurabh Verma to serve is down by four points stand 14 in the decider Absolutely incredible. This is electric. For a moment, uh, you would be excused if you thought it's a video game playing out or something. But no, this is the level of badminton and it's all happening in Goa here at the 37th National Games. A brilliant point here for M. Tarun as the battle of taps gets him a point. 15-10, M. Tarun leads. In this third and final game, Elroy, this is so amazing level of badminton and a great opportunity, especially for our Goan badminton players and youngsters to come here and watch the action. I think that's absolutely correct, Neeraj. We need to have uh, youngsters watching the sport, watching these top class players performing, and as that is called in. Four points, the deficit now, sort of Varma's. Spirit and fight must be commended, of course, and this is exactly what the youngsters who come to watch the game would be looking at. Not giving up, and uh, there was a fantastic rally there from both sets of players. That that is exactly what high-quality badminton is all about. Both sets of players going for it all. A 
no chance. Whoa, yes. that is just a big missile landing onto Saurabh court. Saurabh Burma's court. This is tremendous jump smash from M. Tarun. The young man from Telangana State. He's holding a five point lead here in this crucial phase in the third and final game. The gold medal is on the line. And M. Tarun, the younger of the two players, is holding a commanding position. But Saurabh Verma, the 30 year old shuttler from MP, is not done yet. Look at that. His net play is absolutely at the very top level. He taps another point. It's 12 16. Seventeen twelve. This is uh, intense, intense badminton. Not just of endurance. Both players have shown remarkable fitness levels out here in this game. Yesterday also, both players. Yesterday also, both players were involved in three-set matches, and uh, we are seeing another three-set uh, final out here. 17-13, Saurabh Verma isn't ready to give up just yet, Neeraj. Of course, he has uh, a steely mind and uh, great experience as well. Probably has dealt with similar situations in the past and come out on top. Who knows? There's maybe a still twist in the tail here. Fourteen, seventeen, and yes, we would want uh, lots of twists and turns. And the uh, umpire, of course, uh, telling telling uh, Tarun that he needs to get back on court. I think the physicality of this game is getting to him. Umpire out here, our chair official, very very strict with the rules, and as and he's well within his rights to do that. Amazing. That's the quality of smash uh, that Am Tarun possesses. This time Saurabh Verma could not defend it. He was uh, not in the closer as closer part of the smash or not in the position. And the smash is now having three points away probably if it goes to the script. Brilliant this time to the left side of Sarwar Burma. In the last point, he hammered it, hammered his smash into the right part of the court. So here we have two consecutive smashes bringing in points for M. Tarun and he leads 19 14. So if it goes the similar script, it will be over in two points. But you can never write off Sarwar Burma. He is capable of anything and everything. The experienced Sarwar Burma. But right now it's all about M. Tarun uh, with the serve in his hand. It's 19-14, two points game. Wow, back from one side of the court to the other. It looks like uh, Saurabh Verma is trying to tire out his opponent, Tarun M, who is looking to finish the games off in a faster manner. As you can see, he's trying to smash it at almost any opportunity that he gets because he's feeling the fatigue of this match. He, twice he was stopped by the chair empire, definitely wanting this game to go on and... Tar uh, Tarun M feeling the pressure of this match 
would he's just a couple of points away from victory but Saurabh Varma would want to try and extend and prolong each point that he plays to hopefully tire his opponent down absolutely every point is vital here for Saurabh Varma and you could see on that last point Tarun M thought he was hopelessly out of position after returning uh, and then Saurabh Varma did place it into the left side of the court and got a point Five match points now with M. Tarun. This final has now gone on for an hour and nine minutes. And it's first match point of the men's single final is with M. Tarun, who leads 2015 in the third and final game. A little fortunate, but then he has made his fortune. He was brave. He has attacked Saurabh Varma more and has won the game 21-15. So it's 21-15, 16-21, Victory in this gold medal match for M. Tarun over Saurabh Varma. The experienced shuttler from MP. Credit to Saurabh Verma, he fought really hard with the younger opponent and he has gone down fighting.